Hi, this is Oliver Lucanus from Below Water. Here's a quick look at what has happened in the Telespiris River. This awesome habitat of rapids and clearwater creeks that drain into it has been destroyed. They have dammed the Telespiris close to the town of Sinop, in a region where most of the Mato Grosso's forests have already been cut to make room for soybeans and cotton. The dam forms a huge 150 square kilometer reservoir that has now permanently flooded the rapids, which is not good for the rheophile fish. Today I want to show you the habitat of Corridoras apiaca that live in small streams heading westwards into the Telespiris. The other bad thing is that the small creeks with clear water which used to drain these rolling hills into the Telespiris have been permanently flooded. So the small fish that only occur in these creeks like Hufesobrucon heliacus and Corridoras apiaca and many others will no longer be able to survive in the standing murky and warmer water of the reservoir. When I filmed this in 2018, this creek was still intact, but the construction crews were moving in, cutting the forest margins and installing big boulders to make sure the creek cannot flood over its banks and damage the road. Then, by 2019, the reservoir had filled and it permanently connected this area to the reservoir. This is what is happening to many of the small habitats and very specialized fish in them. It is important to see that the dams don't just eliminate the flood pulse that is so vital for all the fish in the river and remove the rapids where so many fish species live, but they also affect these small habitats. Of course this is happening all over the world, but here with the fires, illegal gold mining, industrial agriculture and agrotoxins, huge cattle farms, deforestation and a warming planet, the effects of the big hydroelectric projects are absolutely devastating on these habitats. Corridoras apiaca love the slower moving water along the margin, where sand has piled up along the shallows, and that is where they search for food. When they get spooked, they escape to the deeper water and let the current take them away. You can see where the current is strong, the substrate consists of these red pebbles with some white quartz pebbles mixed in. Unfortunately, more and more of these beautiful streams will disappear in our lifetime and many of the fish that occur here along with them. Make sure to click subscribe at the end of this video.